to VA. Let me tell y'all. I ain't never rode a bus before by myself. <laughs> you just see some things at the bus station, child. You really... <laughs> I look like who did it and why. But I don't want to be ghetto and put my bonnet on. I'm sure my bonnet. I have a jumbo bonnet. Put all this hair in, okay? Gotta protect all the hair, y'all. It's a tight rope. And I have a three and a half hour layover. <laughs> three and a half hours. My bus literally does not come until nine o'clock. It is 6.44. That's a long time. That is a long time. I haven't seen two pimps since I've been here. A hooker. Three crackheads. I just can't. Like, mm -mm. I'm not moving into my bus now. I wipe down the seat. Period. They won't get me. Okay. Help me, Jason. I ain't got nothing to do. I don't look a mess. I look like I've been traveling, don't I? Wait a minute. Hooters. Ew. <laughs> I forgot I was in public. Ew. Period. Okay. But I got all the snacks. Popcorn, apple, salad, gushers, fruit roll-ups. Girl. I got everything. I bought the whole stuff yesterday. I said, no, I bought this today. <laughs> there was a lot. She would not be hungry. Okay. So there's this mysterious bag next to me. This bag been sitting here since I've been sitting. I've been sitting here for like 45 minutes already. And nobody can get the damn bag. Look at it. It looked dirty. It was hair hanging out of the bag. So I know it's a lady bag. She just forgot her whole bag. Girl. And if I was nice, I would take it up to the front part of my book. I ain't about to touch this damn bag now. It could be roaches, animals, bugs, babies and all. I don't want it. I don't want it. I don't want it at all. 